testing your house for indoor air quality is, um, well, for ventilation requirements, uh, is a very actually straightforward. Uh, you need somebody that has a blower door, and what they would do is they would come in and uh, set up the blower door, and they would have to calculate the air changes per hour at a pressure difference, and going through some more calculations, which most uh, HERS raters and BPI certified uh, building analysts or envelope analysts would, would know, uh, they could come up with a figure of uh, what the air changes per hour are at a natural pressure. And in an existing house, the standard is 0.35 air changes per hour, or you can think of it as the air in your house has to turn over entirely about every three hours. If it's less than the air, excuse me, if the air, if it takes more than three hours to turn over the air in your house, then you need some kind of ventilation system. Otherwise, you're probably okay. Uh, the in, in terms of air quality, it really is. Um, it would have to be tested where you take a sample of air and then send it out to a lab and test it. And to be honest, I don't know anybody who actually does that to test the air quality. Uh, indications that you might have an air quality issue is that if uh, if smells linger around in your house for you know an extended period of time or become bothersome. I mean, those are the kinds of things that it really when it impinges on your comfort. It's probably the only way you could. Uh, tell that I know of. So another question that came up is what kind of rebates are available for uh, ventilation equipment, the HRVs, the ERVs, and uh, you know bathroom fans. And uh, I, actually I, there, there may be under circum certain under certain circumstances you can get rebates for HRVs and ERVs. I believe it's through either the Gas Networks program or the Cool Smart program, and you access all of the programs through uh, a website called um, uh, Desire.USA and or MassSave.com. MassSave.com is basically in Massachusetts. Go there. That is the portal to energy efficiency programs at the state level. Uh, the other thing that you can think about is that there are also, when you're looking for money back, that's all done at the state level. When you, uh, but there are also tax credits that are available at the federal level, the state level, and, um, and, and sometimes at the local level. If, if your electricity is provided by a municipal electric company, sometimes they also have uh, energy efficiency programs. So those are the other places where uh, you know our clients, you know residents in Massachusetts can go.